Researchers at the University of Texas are tackling some of the coolest magic out there, invisibility. KXAN's Natalie Stoll met up with them today to see how it all works. My body's gone. I don't know what that is. That's an invisibility cloak. Here, invisibility cloak, and it seems straight out of Harry Potter. But UT researchers have developed an invisibility cloak for this world. So what you see here is a, a cylinder. You see the top of the cylinder that is illuminated by a radio wave. And as the radio wave hits the surface of the object, it gets scattered all around. What we do is to design a cover or a cloak to put around the object. So here's how the experiment works. To test our idea, we first start with a cylinder like a rod, dielectric rod, a ceramic uh, rod. After turning on the radio wave, the robot scans all around. It measures how the wave gets distorted. The next step, cloak the cylinder. This is the first cloak, if you will. Notice how thick the outside layer is. The goal was to develop something much thinner, like this one. The latest version of this uh, uh, cloak, we named it mantle cloak, because it is, uh, has the advantage of being uh, extremely thin and flexible. So thin, it's less than a millimeter thick. So this can have uh, more exciting applications. For instance, imagine if you have a, a post, like a metallic post in front of an antenna. By placing this uh, flexible surface around it, the uh, post would essentially disappear to the antenna. So it can improve uh, wireless communications and uh, um, allow you better reception for cellular communications, for instance, or radio. And about that cloak that make a person disappear, it's not completely out of reach. If we wanted to scale down these concepts to light and make an object disappear to our eyes rather than to a radar, then we would uh, uh, need to scale everything down and the object itself would become much smaller. In Central Austin, Natalie Stoll, KXAN News. It seems scientists at the University of Texas in Austin are in a race with several other contenders to claim the invisibility cloak invention. In fact, UT Dallas is causing a stir with its own vanishing technology. Findings caused a flurry of media coverage around the nation and the world, really. It was in CNN, Huffington Post, Wired Magazine, and at a recent Technology Education and Design, or TED, conference out in Los Angeles. Scientists demonstrated a small box made of calcite optic crystal that was used to bend light around an object. It made anything placed behind the box appear invisible. Take a close look at this video. It's gone viral. It allegedly shows U.S. Army soldiers in Iraq dressed in cloaking camouflage. The short clip is fueling theories that the U.S. military is already testing invisible technology on the battlefield. Two DOD advanced research agencies confirm several cloaking techniques are under development but are a long way from practical use. And of course anyone who's a fan of the Harry Potter series knows the invisible cloak. The cloak is a magical garment which renders whatever it covers unseeable. Now they may be made from hair of a magical creature that possesses the power to become invisible. So if you wear a cloak, you become invisible.